The U.S. Supreme Court issued two historic rulings on same-sex marriage Wednesday morning. One that says if you are legally married in a gay couple, you get the same federal, federal benefits as any other married couple. The second that could quickly allow gay couples to marry in the state of California once again. The two decisions are seen as major victories by marriage equality advocates and have same-sex couples across the country rejoicing. Just after the announcement, President Obama currently aboard Air Force One on a flight to Senegal reportedly called to congratulate the California couple that brought Prop 8 to the Supreme Court. President Obama is the first U.S. president to come out in support for marriage equality. In a statement released Wednesday, the president says he applauds the Supreme Court's decision to strike down the Defense of Marriage Act. This was discrimination enshrined in law. It treated loving, committed, gay and lesbian couples as a separate and lesser class of people. The Supreme Court has righted that wrong and our country is better off for it. But President Obama wasn't the only politician weighing in on the court's decision. In his statement, Republican House Speaker John Boehner criticized the justices for what he believes is an overstep in the U.S. system of checks and balances. While I am obviously disappointed in the ruling, it is always critical that we protect our system of checks and balances. A robust national debate over marriage will continue in the public square, and it is my hope that states will define marriage as the union between one man and one woman. Several politicians released statements after the court's announcement, including openly gay Congressman Mark Takano. The California Democrat says, I feel jubilation. I feel fabulous. I feel every gay word I can think of. Social media also exploded with opinions about the ruling shortly after they were announced. Former Arkansas governor and current Fox News host Mike Huckabee tweeted, five people in robes said they are bigger than the voters of California and Congress combined and bigger than God. May he forgive us all. While another show host, Ellen DeGeneres, said it's a supremely wonderful day for equality. Prop 8 is over and so is DOMA. Congratulations everyone, and I mean everyone. Even Google is weighing in on the issue, releasing a special Easter egg for those who type gay into the search box. With the court overturning the Defense of Marriage Act, the federal government will now extend more than 1,000 benefits and programs to married couples in states where same-sex marriage is legalized. For Newsy, I'm Jamal Landris. Multiple sources, a broader view.